Everywhere that Green Councillors have influence, in places like Kirklees, Brighton, Sheffield, Norwich and Oxford, we see our Green Councillors pushing for a new requirement that at least 50% of new housing must be affordable. They're also pushing for assistance for elderly and other vulnerable people to get assistance to insulate their homes properly. They're campaigning for brownfield sites to be converted to social housing. And they're insisting that we have to upgrade the standards of social housing to ensure greater energy and fuel efficiency. Green housing is about a better quality of life, about social justice and about protecting the environment. Greens in Oxford have been working on housing issues for many years now and we've been very successful. We've initiated planning policies that mean that every development of 10 or more houses, half of them have to be through a housing association for low rent. All the new developments have to have 20% of renewables generated on site. With our own council tenants, we've provided information and advice on reducing energy costs and we're installing um, renewables on council flats at this, at this time. Elderly and, and poorer residents can now get free insulation for their houses. Uh, this is a, not only a sustainability measure, but it's actually an anti-poverty measure. We've redeveloped derelict council-owned garage sites for social housing because in a, a high-density city like Oxford, we are very, very pressured for land and we desperately need more affordable housing. We've worked with council officers on improving the quality of private rented accommodation and have had many successes with, with standards going up quite considerably in some areas.